Here we go again in Niggerland. The family of a Jackson firefighter is grieving this evening after the man's shooting death. That happened earlier today in the 200 block of Ferguson Drive near McDowell Road. Now, Police Chief Joseph Wade says officers responded to a welfare check at the dwelling. Now, they learned 49-year-old Gerald Bates had been shot to death and that a woman with a firearm remained inside the house. Now, JPD SWAT members deployed and were able to arrest the suspect, 41-year-old Tammy Williams. Now, family members say Williams was Bates' girlfriend. Friend. She was done at the plan. We deployed our SWAT team. They came out, deployed tear gas inside the home, was able to get her out without any incident. Unfortunately, it was a very, very aggressive dog inside the house. They had to be put down. But the lady was brought into custody, Tammy Williams, without any incident. I know how hard he worked to get at the fire department. And now he accomplished his dream, got at the fire department, and then this happened. You know, I, I just say to anybody out there, be mindful who you connect with. Be mindful of the relationship that you have with people, girlfriend, boyfriend, whatever, because it, it means everything. Here it is, our cousin life is gone, taken. One because of sickness, <laughs> one because of anything like that, but because of gunshot, murder. Now, if you have any additional information about the slaying, please contact Crime Stoppers at 601-355-TIPS or the Jackson Police Department. That was in the video, you guys. Sound like that was domestic. Don't forget, you guys, Jesus Christ is king. I love those who love me. The video will be in the description below.